At Necessite, an inclusive platform, we bring to you curated mindful products, great fun recipes you can do at home for the modern way of eating and cooking. Come along with us and share and learn more for yourself, your loved ones, and your home. Enjoy! Hi, thanks for tuning in. I'm Erica Reed with Necessite TV. Alrighty. I'm the modern woman and so are you and we just don't have time to cook all day but we have to eat to sustain ourselves and our families and it's part of what we have to do when we want to nourish ourselves well. Super duper easy, again another easy recipe. This one is cauliflower steak. You may have heard of it, you may have seen it on a menu somewhere and then again you may not have and that's why you're here so you can find out what cauliflower steak is. So. I already cut this off earlier because I wasn't thinking. I cut it off. But typically it comes like this in the grocery store and you do want to cut this off. You rinse it really good, wash it. I like to brush it and I dry it like such on a towel, paper towel, whatever it is that you have. So I buy cauliflower organic because we consume the entire thing and there is no barrier between what we're going to eat. There's no skin. So I always try and make sure it's organic. But again, if it's not organic, it's okay. Do what works for you. If it's not organic, if you can't get organic, if you cannot, you know, it may be too costly. Um, it may not be in your budget, which is totally fine. You can still get the cauliflower. Do not let your budget stop you from eating proper vegetables and nutrients that you need. So here we are. I love a good old cast iron skillet. And that's pretty much what I use a lot when I cook. So I'm just gonna drizzle a little bit of oil. My cast iron always has oil in it because my mother taught me when I was younger, you have to season it. You have to season your cast iron. You have to season it. When I moved on my own out of college and after sleeping on floors and out of the country and stuff, she bought me a cast iron to cook and she's like, you have to season it. So it's seasoned. So now my kids season it. So what you do is you just put your oil in and you take paper towel, you rub it around. So I already have some oil in here, but I just drizzled a little more. And what we're going to do, we're going to just pretend we just cut that off. Okay. So you have that. And now you just take your cauliflower and just cut down. And this is your cauliflower steak. <laughs> I didn't make the name up, but that's what they call it. So I'm going to put it down, just absorbing a little bit of the oil. And I'm gonna drizzle, I'm using avocado oil, but use coconut, uh, excuse me, use, um, well, if you wanna use coconut oil, you can but I'm using avocado oil or you can use olive oil. And like anything else you eat, you want it to be seasoned well. You cannot have food that does not taste good. So I'm using a little bit of cumin. Cumin is a good old spice. And if my memory serves me correct, it's a really big spice in the Indian culture and I love it when I go to Indian restaurants and I'm using a little bit of curry which is also a very well-known Indian spice and you don't have to use it put whatever you want on here if you just want salt and pepper that's totally fine um, just play with it and again turmeric for me because it's it helps with inflammation and I just feel I could never go wrong with it so, you know, from the garden, my cilantro and parsley, both very high in nutrients. Parsley is great for your liver. And I'm just gonna sprinkle a little. I'm not a chef, don't judge me. I'm our chef. And you're gonna be your chef for your family. We're just not professionally trained. We're necessity trained. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna put this on, uh, it's already on, it, I preheated this. I have it on broil. So, I just stick it in. 
All right, I think our cauliflower steak is ready. Woo, baby, it's ready. Look at that. That's the cauliflower steak. And it's hot. Do not burn yourself. Let's turn this off or shut the door because it's hot. I like to put the mitts on top just so you don't burn yourself. I don't stick it on the handle on this one because the inside, it always gets stuck on the heat. But typically I do, but this one's not working. All right, so here's the cauliflower steak. Well, I didn't get a big enough plate. So I'm gonna cut on this plate because I don't wanna cut on my cast iron. But this is it. You can drizzle a little bit of lemon on this. I'm sharing this with the person that's making this all possible for us to watch this video. In case you're wondering, who is she cutting another per plate for? So this is it. This is how your cauliflower, I want a little cayenne pepper, but I don't want it on every single one. And I want a little bit of lemon. I just like lemon. And I'm not gonna squeeze it on each one and you don't have to either, but here we go. The moment everybody's been waiting for, right? Okay, here we are. Take your time, chew slowly, give thanks, be grateful. You have something to eat. There's so many people out there right now that can only watch. So be grateful that you have something to eat. Chew slowly, be mindful, be appreciative. Enjoy. Mm. Thanks for watching. I'm Erica Reed with Necessitate TV.